You know, you can always bug people in a beautiful way, in a very helpful way, by just saying to them, what did you forget? So, well, I don't know. What was I supposed to remember? Oh, I'm, not, I'm, I'm really not trying to put you on. I, I mean, it's not difficult. This is something completely obvious that you forgot. You, you'd easily remember it because it's so obvious. Well, that's the hardest thing in the world to think of. Yeah, what's that? Well, who do you think you are? Well, how do you answer that question? Who are you? Well, you give a name. You say, I'm... Joe Dokes, I'm Alan Watts. That's not true. That's what people told you you were. They put that name on you and they taught you to identify with it and to behave as it was expected to behave. But that's not who you are. You know very well. Go back in your memory. Go back into your infancy before they started telling you all the stuff. Who are you? And if you get with that, you'll know uh, very well who you are. The jolly old ancient of days. Only there's a conspiracy that you mustn't let on about that. Because everybody is. And uh, if one person realizes it, the other's a little bit offended. And they say, well, uh, how come you're so great? Because we have all been living in a theory of the universe in which the individual is simply involved in something that happens to him. See, it's always something other than you. You don't recognize it as an integral part of your own being, without which you cannot know what you mean by the word I. But in the truth of the matter is, though, that if uh, you will face it out, every single one of us knows that that isn't true. So that what we mean by the capacity of voluntary control in the ordinary sense of the word is, isn't it? We don't understand it at all. So you might say, in, in a funny backwards way, that the only kind of control you really understand is that way you're not using your will. Because you just do it so easy like you open and close your hand you know how to do it sure you know how to do it but you can't put it into words and explain to someone how to do it you say well come on aren't you human don't you know how to open and close your hand just do it silly but we don't realize you see that just as we know how to do this we know equally well how to turn the sun into light how to blow the sky, how to blow the wind, how to wave the, the ocean, how to um, digest food, and um, I might add, to be digested by bacteria and transformed. As we transform our steaks, uh, we will in turn be transformed. But the um, pattern keeps going, and it's always you. Only you see you have this marvelous capacity to transform yourself without knowing that you're doing it. Therefore, you keep surprising yourself. And therefore, you keep on doing it. Because if you didn't surprise yourself, you wouldn't go, you wouldn't go on doing it. It's just the very fact, you see, that you seem to be the victims of a thing you don't understand and that you seem to conclude your life every time in a wipeout called death where all your control goes is just exactly that opposite condition to what you call being alive that allows you to be alive. Only every time it happens, it's like it's new. It's like every time you're born, it seems like it was the only time. But of course, if it wasn't like that, you wouldn't do it. 